Hello everyone, this is Joe Cool 10 Welcome back to Let's Play Axis and Allies. Last time, the Allies won the fight, and so now we are going to start as the Axis here. Hmm. So we're going to be putting the, the Allies here on medium, just to make things a bit more challenging for us, because otherwise the Allies on easy is just way too easy for the Axis to handle, so... We're going to make things a bit more complex here and see how it goes for us. So of course the computer will play as Russia here. So, so as Germany here, we're going to want to uh, focus on the ground battle first, even though uh, the British Navy is going to be kind of a thorn in our side, we won't be able to do a whole lot against them right now. So what we want to do here is we're going to buy a couple tanks and some men. And what we want to do is we want to head for, we want to try to take our Karelia SSR as soon as we possibly can. Because that is our ultimate goal here. So we're going to move as many troops here as we can into Karelia. And I'm going to leave these three men in Finland, Norway to defend against the British troops. We're going to move all of these men here. Okay, we want, we want our bomber to attack. Okay, and then uh, those guys we're going to leave there. That we're going to put there. And then over here in Africa, uh, we want to. Basically, America is going to try to send troops over to to deal with us in Africa, but we're just going to group our guys together for right now uh, because we can't send anyone over right now. And what we're going to do, what I'm going to try to do is I'm going to try to take out uh, this bow, this British battleship here because the sooner you can wipe out the British fleet, the better. But it's going to be very difficult at this point in the game. So let's go ahead and take our Corellia here. Well, first the ships here. Okay, so they hit us. We got them. Okay. We took out their battleship. Unfortunately, that took care of pretty much the rest of our fleet. We only have a transport left, and that's going to get taken out pretty fast. So... So with that, uh, so now one of our planes got taken out, so let's see how we do here now. Four men, okay. We're going to keep going here. And a couple men in a tank, we're going to keep going. And one tank. Okay, so now for our non-combat move, we want to put our planes here in Ukraine to defend. Except for our bomber, because our bomber isn't going to be able to do much. And so now we have some defense here for Corellia. Most likely Russia is going to try to reclaim it next turn, but hopefully we can uh, at least take out some of the troops. In the meantime, we're going to place all of our troops here in the capital, and that will do for us. Now Britain's going to start assembling their troops here. And they're already attacking. They lost. Okay. So now for Japan here, what we want to do 
is we need to take out the American fleet as soon as possible because we don't want America throwing, uh, or th trying to thwart our plans here. So we're going to first concentrate on the battle here in Hawaii and undo the aircraft carrier move. Because we want our carrier there. And we're going to take one of our planes here from the capital and put it out by Hawaii. And we're going to take our sub here as well. And is there any more ships I can bring into the fight here that will help us? Probably not. So, and now with our guys here, we want to, uh, well, they left India undefended, so I'm obviously going to take that. We want to advance our troops here and take out as much as we can here. We're not, uh, not really too worried about Russia because uh, their efforts are going to be focused more so on Germany right now. Uh, so we can. Uh, take our time with them. Yeah, okay. And. Don't think that there's a whole lot else that Japan can do right now, but it's fine. Because we've got our Hawaii battle. Okay, we, we can't afford to lose our carrier, so. Gotta lose our sub here. And now we gotta lose something else. I'm gonna. We will we we would lose one of our planes anyway, so I'm gonna I'm gonna get one of my planes and we won that battle now. Come on, take him out, take him out. There you go. Okay, so for a non combat move we're gonna place this plane back in French Undo China. And this plane we're gonna place here too for extra defense. And I think that's about it. We c no, we can we could have maybe taken Soviet Far East, but it wouldn't have gained us a whole lot. So we're gonna finish up for now, and that will do. So now it's America's turn. So they're gonna send troops over to Africa as I expected, and the rest of their fleet is retreating. Russia reclaimed Karelia, not surprised. But they did leave themselves very vulnerable. Okay, so now we want to get ourselves uh, uh, some more tanks. Yeah, three, will, three and seven will do. So now we're out of transport, so we got we just gotta kind of hold our ground here in Africa as much as we can. Uh, here, so I might. They're gonna probably reclaim Algeria from us, but that's not too big of an issue. Uh, Britain's got plenty of defense going for themselves here. Unfortunately, we have no way of taking Kakuis for from Russia right now, but it's fine because we don't really. I don't really care about that, so I'm gonna go after Karelia again. Move these guys here. Move the planes in for extra damage. And we'll also bring in the bomber again just because we can. Uh, I kind of want to leave my tanks there because I want to try to defend that as much as I can here. Because we want to try to take out Corellia as soon as we can here. Good, no casualties. That really helped us that there was no ca casualties there in Corellia. So um, they may have enough support to try to reclaim Corellia, but hopefully, uh, one of these turns we can overpower them and and stuff. So we'll see how that goes. So Britain's gonna try to bring troops over here. Okay. Uh, hang on. Can maybe get a couple transports. Yeah, maybe just one. I prefer more men, actually. 
Okay, so now the uh, chase begins here. So we do want to we do want to try to leave a ship uh, here by the United States here if we can. But uh, I'm not too worried about the West Coast stuff. So we're gonna bring our fleet over here and take out these American fleets here. Our goal is going to be is to try to block off America here on the east side because that's really going to hurt. That's going to shut America down pretty quickly here. So now over here on the western front, somehow Russia was able to take Mongolia even though that's a neutral territory. Don't ask me how they were able to do that. But anyways, it's fine because they left themselves kind of undefended here. Here I might actually take out the uh, troops here, and then these guys here can go there. And let's go. Oh, we have to do three. Okay, Manchuria, and then might might as well uh, move this guy forward here. Even though these British troops might try to might try to take him out, I don't think they're going to. So it's fine. And don't think that there's much else that Japan can really do right now. So we have a naval battle here, and then we have the battle. Okay. Uh, I can't afford to lose my carrier because then my plane or. Because then my plane would die as well. Come on, there we go. All right, we'll put these guys here to defend China, and we will go ahead and place our men here. And now America's turn. Yep, they're gonna, of course, take Algeria naturally. Why are you building stuff, America? It's not going to help you. Okay. Ooh! Russia did not reclaim Karelia. This is good news for us. Uh, yeah, let's do that. I want tanks. Okay, so now that Russia has not taken back Karelia, Russia is pretty much going to be in big trouble here. So we can uh, advance. We can advance some of our guys here to Karelia to uh, defend or to to defend it as much as we possibly can here. And we're just going to keep our British troops right here, kind of staying tight here in Africa. Uh, or our German troops here, sorry. I don't know why I said British. We're German. We're just going to leave let our troops sit tight. We want to, now that we own Karelia, we need to defend it as much as we possibly can here. Because now what we want to do is we want to try to take out the capital here. And so... I'm hoping that they're going to go after Kakuas here, and then uh, we can uh, hopefully weaken them and take out the capital very soon. Because the sooner we can take out the Russia, the better for us. So that'll do for now. And uh, now we can place units here in Karelia. So that makes this yes, we get to place three units in Karelia. And they're gonna attack Finland in Norway. That's fine. You're a little late there, Britain. Okay. Okay, so now uh we get to we can move our troops here. And now Russia's in a pretty bad situation here as it turns out here so we can we can advance our troops here 
take out these planes here in Mongolia. Okay. And Russia is pretty much is pretty much done for now. Uh, they don't have much left for them. So we'll go ahead and hopefully take out these planes here. Okay, one of my guys was left behind to take back Mongolia. Oh, uh, hang on here. Okay, so we have our fleet here. So unfortunately, I didn't do any. Oh, I can't. I can't even move them through the Panama Canal. So I gotta go around the long way anyway. So it's fine. I had to move them anyway, but we can't move them through the canal because uh, America owns it. Okay. And uh, as soon as it gets to Germany's turn here, I'm going to call an episode here. Uh, they took back Ukraine. Oh well. No worries. Uh, they're building fleet on the west coast now. That's bad. Okay, so in the next episode, we will hope to take out Russia here very soon. Because that is our first order of business. Once Russia is out... Uh, it will be much easier for us. So until next time, this is Joe Cool 10 signing out.